today we are going on a road trip. We are going to bring you to Antipolo! Antipolo City is the capital of Rizal province located at 13 kilometers east of Manila. Also known as a famous Catholic pilgrimage site, it sits at the foot of the longest mountain range in the country called the Sierra Madre. This city is known for proudly Filipino delicacies like suman and kalamay. It is the nearest place you can go to for a quick getaway from Metro Manila with easily accessible panoramic view of the Manila skyline. After almost one hour of driving, we are near to our first destination. Are you ready to eat? Are you hungry? Of course! Hungry as ever! According to their reservations, you have to wear comfortable shoes and elderly and the young kids are not very much um, advised to go here because it takes more than 90 steps before you can get to the actual restaurant. So as you can see, there are very steep steps going up and down. So you really have to be cautious where you're going. High heels are not recommended unless you are an expert when it comes to walking in high heels. So I wore my comfy shoes today and we're ready to go down Burrow. So we are now here at our first destination and I'm so excited because we're going to try this for the first time. So come with us today and let's eat! <laughs> Burrow Cafe is a hidden gem inside the private subdivision of Beverly Hills and Tipolo. It is stuck within a sloping terrain that overlooks a river. This coffee shop and restaurant is only accessible through a narrow staircase within a popular shop venue which is Antipolo Bee House. Welcome to Boro Cafe! The place was conceptualized and designed by the owners themselves. With big windows allowing natural daylight to enter, and the beautiful greens of the area to make anyone gush at its nature-inspired theme. First food that we're going to try is the Nomi Taco. It has a uh, Fried bean, cilantro, tomato salsa, cashew sard. So it looks really good. I like that it is in a bite size that I know that I can finish this in one bite. So it's very exciting. Let's try it. First thing that I could taste is the sourness, the sour cream, and also the tomato, and then the cilantro. I can I can taste the combination of the flavors. Mm. Mm. 
Yummus. Yummus hummus. That's a hummus. It's like tasting a salad in a bite-sized form. So the next thing that we're going to taste is the eggs benedict. Okay, try na natin tong eggs uh, benedict. I think ano yung homemade din yung sourdough bread ang ginagamit dito eh. So, yan, ito yung, mga, ito yung pinagmamalaki nila dito sa Barrow Cafe. Sweet, na may crunchy texture, na may chewy texture. Sarap siya. Yeah, it's very light. No, there's no distinct strong flavor that you can taste it. And everything, everything that they've put here has mild flavor. So you don't feel overwhelmed and hindi siya nakakaumay. The yellow one tastes like mashed potato with rice. It's very creamy, cheesy. And let's taste it with the beef. Because it has here, it's wine braised. Wine braised beef cheese. Let's see. With the squash orzo. So the squash orzo is our rice. The beef is very tender. It melts in your mouth, so it's also flavorful. I can taste the the meatiness of the beef. I can feel that it this beef has been marinated. It's so tender. Mm. Yum. Mm. Super, super, super tender. Yay! Antipolo B House is a very popular place when it comes to shoots. And we're here almost every month, especially me as a makeup artist. And I don't think that Antipolo B House is accessible to, to those who are just eating here in the restaurant. So if you want to see uh, what Antipolo B House looks like, I will give you a tour. Actually, my past self will give you a tour because I just had a shoot here a few days ago before we ate here today. So, take it away, past me yet. So, right now we're here at Antipolo B House, and as you can see, the place is very ideal for having your shoot done. It's very cozy, homey, with a good um, combination of indoor and outdoor shoot. It's very ideal for prenup and all kinds of shoot where you need the homey place. The whole area is very photogenic. It's no wonder that this place is very popular when it comes to pre-wedding shoots and sometimes pre-debut shoot as well. They're crunchy suman alamon, and it's their take on the local delicacy of Antipolo, which is suman. And let's have a taste. It's crunchy outside and warm inside. It's the suman inside is very warm. I like how they, how it complements the crunchiness and it also has a vanilla ice cream which you can put on top of the suman. Flavors again are balanced and I also have to comment how everything was plated very nicely. It, it looks very good when you take a photo of it. If you're looking for a very sweet chocolatey dessert, 
this is not for you. But if you like suman and if you like just a, a very light taste for dessert, I recommend you to order this. Mm. So it is uh, what it says it is. It is fried or crunchy suman. Pero sa tingin ko maganda combine natin yung mga ibang elements sa dessert na to. No? So the ice cream, the fried suma, mm. and the mango. Mm. Sarap. Perfect siya pag kinumbine mo lahat. Sarap siya. Kira, check natin yung liver sa baba. Hello guys, we are on our day 2 of our Where to Eat in Antipolo and now we have some company because we are with our kids today, Savvy and Zach. So unlike the first restaurant that we went to where kids are not allowed, we found a restaurant that allows kids and also seniors. So we are so excited to finally bring them out so they can also enjoy some outdoors and we're so excited to try the food of Tipolo! Tipolo is named after the Tipolo tree and the city of Antipolo. It is located along Sumulong Highway inside First Pacific Leadership Academy. It offers a modern take on the Filipino cuisine where typical Filipino food like kare kare and lumpia can be ordered. They have wide open spaces for alfresco dining, which is surrounded by lush greenery, which makes it great for relaxing and spending time with all the members of your family. So we are now here at Tipolo Restaurant. And before we were able to book a table, you have to reserve in advance. Uh, according to their Facebook page, you can only book to them through their special booking process, which is you have to go to their Facebook page, you have to message them, you have to fill up the reservation form, and when they reply, you have to send the payment in advance, depending on the number of people in your group. So if there will be only two people, um, dining in, you have to pay 500 per head. But if there will be four or more people, it's 200 pesos per head, which is all consumable. And you can easily use it to pay for your food here at the restaurant.
are currently um, we're not yet done eating at the restaurant but so far actually we didn't make an individual review of the food because it's actually just a typical Filipino restaurant and it's it's nothing special actually and the food for me is just average see even yung kare kare yung meat niya is a bit uh, at the tough side so hindi siya yung uh, uh, malambot even yung crisp uh, onion yung bichon kawali medyo medyo matigas din ng konti pero masarap pa rin naman the thing that makes this place extra special is because you can bring your kids so i think that's that's very important especially for parents just to be able to see your kids run around play around so breathe some fresh air and be surrounded by nature that's already a plus plus point for us so if that if that's what you're looking for it's a good place for you to bring your kids and enjoy the company of each other yes so there there's our review of our two places in antipolo which you could check out so if you want us to try something else or if you want us to to visit so, uh, a place that you know that's really good, you can comment down below. And also, we would appreciate it if you like and subscribe to our channel. So, see you again, guys. Bye! <laughs>